is Minecraft compatible with a Steam Deck, and if so, to what extent? In my previous video about Steam Deck, I covered what this new device is all about and why I can't buy one at launch. It's simply not available in Australia right now. I also said that yes, the Steam Deck will run Minecraft, but I had an error in that video, which people were all too ready to point out. Thank you for that. Shout out to Adel Bjorn for being the first to mention this in the comments. I directly implied by mistake that you would have to install Windows 10 or Windows 11 to run Minecraft Java Edition on the Steam Deck, and that's not true. Minecraft Java Edition will run on the default operating system that comes with the device called SteamOS. But as some caveats if you want to run Bedrock Edition or Minecraft Dungeons. More on that in a moment. Valve is currently working hard on the newest version of SteamOS for the deck's launch. In fact, they're making quite significant changes under the hood. For those of you that are familiar with the difference, the new version of SteamOS, version 3, is based on Arch Linux, not Debian as it was previously. Now, Arch isn't all that user-friendly, so you shouldn't install it on your computer if you're new to Linux. But Valve is handling all of the complexities in this case, so the Steam Deck should be relatively plug and play. So why the switch? Pardon the pun. It's not the focus of this video, but Arch Linux has more of a move fast rolling update approach and will allow Valve to iterate much faster on SteamOS 3.0. And Valve wants to release multiple small updates, constantly iterating to improve compatibility and usability as needs arise. That's where other non-Linux games come in. In the case of Minecraft Java Edition, it runs on the Java Virtual Machine, or the JVM. And the JVM is already compatible with Windows, Mac, and Linux, and almost anything else you can think of. So Minecraft Java Edition will run natively on the Arch Linux based SteamOS, along with Fabric Mods and Forge Mods as well. But what about Bedrock Edition? And what about Minecraft Dungeons? Do you need to install Windows on the Steam Deck for those games? While they aren't on the Steam Store, they should still run on SteamOS directly, and that's all thanks to something called Proton, a compatibility layer that Valve is working on to make Windows apps run natively on the Steam Deck. Windows 10, and very likely Windows 11 as well, should be installable on the Deck if you want to but it probably won't be a requirement to run Minecraft, any version of Minecraft. You should be able to still run those on SteamOS. But there's another question that comes up from all of this, controls. Bedrock Edition and Minecraft Dungeons are designed with a controller in mind. Java Edition Minecraft is not. How will you play the Java Edition of Minecraft without a mouse and keyboard? As Panificium wrote, the deck is a handheld PC and a controller. How well will Java Edition handle controllers? There's two points I can raise for this. Firstly, a mouse, keyboard, and external monitor can be connected to the Steam Deck. That just means that you can play Minecraft Java the way it was intended. But secondly, even in handheld mode, it should be fine. Let's just say that Valve has limited us to the Steam Deck interface in handheld, which is a very real possibility. It should still be possible to launch non-Steam games from that UI. As Dizzy Barn Art mentioned, even if you are locked to SteamOS UI when in handheld, you can add your Mojang Minecraft executable to your Steam library. And the controller issue has already been solved as well. There are already mods, including Controllable by Mr. Crayfish, which allow you to play Minecraft Java Edition with a standard game controller. And I'm sure that either Controllable or some other mod will add direct support for the Steam Deck once it's launched, including perhaps giving us a use for those extra buttons on the back. So when it comes to whether Minecraft will run on the Steam Deck, the answer is a resounding yes, at least for Java Edition. The only unanswered question is how to get a copy of the executables for Bedrock Edition and Minecraft Dungeons onto the Steam Deck in the first place. If the community finds a way, Proton means that running the executable itself shouldn't be a problem. If you enjoyed this video, please share it with others that also play Minecraft and have a fantastic day. Thank you to my patrons, you're all legends.